Welcome everybody, I'm Pierre Averge, the Daily Trader. Let's look at Tesla's stock. So um, let's look at what happened uh, on uh, Friday, the 26th of uh, fe February. So basically, uh, Tesla has been in a downtrend since uh, January 26th. So this is the first downtrend here. Uh, a very slow slope then it uh, went into a second steeper slope and uh, we can also see that there's a third there's a third slope here so the first point is here the second here third here so so far Tesla is in a downtrend this is not the time to buy Tesla yet it's going to come a day when it's going to be time to buy Tesla, but not right now. So please be patient. You don't want to buy something that is still going down. Yes, it's lower. So some people only see the stock market as a thermometer and oh, this is this price. It's at this price. Now it's it's lower. I buy. No, 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 no. This is not this is not how the stock market works. It works in trend. You need to look at the chart. So looking at the chart, it's very easy to see that Tesla is in a downtrend, uh, a third speed downtrend that I like to call. The first speed is this one here, second speed and the third speed. The third speed I drew in a light color because uh, the third speed is less, less important or less critical. So uh, it's very possible that the stock goes sideways uh, and then breaks uh, the third downtrend and and obeys to the second one. So this is why I drew it in the light color. So we also see that uh, this horizontal line here is really well respected. So the stock on the 23rd of February closed or closed above here, opened opened here and closed here. So it respected this horizontal resistance, then went a bit higher. And now it's been touching. It touched on Friday, last Friday, it touched that horizontal resistance again. So which resistance is going to win? Is it the third downtrend resistance, the third uh, trend line that, that is going to win? or is it the support line that is going to win we'll see on monday or tuesday so right now it's not a buy um is it a sell well it could be a sell if it breaks this horizontal line so um last thing i want to say is uh, talk a bit about uh, stochastic stochastic is very very low at around uh, 27 percent the macd is um the MACD has crossed a long time ago. It crossed on January 27, 26th. So that could have been a signal to sell at that point. But it's not always true to only listen to uh, only one indicator. It's when a couple of indicators, two or three or even more, combine with the trend lines that uh, this is how you can make a better decision. And the DMI is very, very uh, bearish again. So because of the stochastic being quite low, um, I don't think Tesla is going in, is going is gonna go up anytime soon. So basically, what I am expecting Tesla to do, there are two choices that I see: is that it's gonna go sideways until it hits the third trend line and then follow it, or it or it is going to um, go sideways respecting the horizontal support but then obey to the third to the second trend line like this of course of course it can it can go back up we we never know for sure but uh, most likely one of these two scenario will happen so uh we'll see this is not financial advice this is only my opinion i am doing this to think out loud and help myself um make better decisions so uh thank you for watching please subscribe please comment and uh we'll see each other uh monday after the close thank you bye